Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel, Inventive Tech, a channel dedicated to new ultimate gadgets and innovations. The automobile has been around for about 125 years. In that time, the world has seen some vehicles that are simply wild, wacky, or weird. The most daring of these are usually concept cars, which aren't limited by practicality or government regulations and can therefore allow automakers to really push the limits. In this video, we are going to talk about the seven strangest cars ever made. So make sure you watch this video till the end. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do so. And I guarantee you will surely love this. Let's get started. Number 7. Loof Electric Loof Electric was a three-wheeled vehicle that was developed during World War II in response to fuel and other rationing and considered the precursor of today's smart car. It's not tough to see how this little electric car earned its name. Fabricated from aluminum with a plexiglass dome, the car was lightweight as well as fuel efficient. Loof Electric, literally the electric egg, was built by French artist, designer, and engineer Paul Arzens in 1942 for personal use. With the 60 mile range and a 37 mile per hour top speed, it was the ultimate urban vehicle years before the first electric Smart for Two took to the streets. Number 6. Nano Helicopter Car Mithilesh Prasad, a man from Chopra village, gave a helicopter look to his Tata Nano car with a rotor blade, a tail, a tail boom, and a rotor mast. Mithilesh, who comes from a farmer's family, always wanted to become a pilot, but he couldn't become one. So to fulfill his dream, he gave his Nano car a helicopter look. However, Mithilesh's Karkum helicopter does not fly. This car helicopter just rolls on the road. He has also fitted colorful LED lights in its rotors and side panels. Mithilesh and his brother took almost seven months to complete the design. They invested RS7 lock in the project. Number 5. Telephone Car Business owner Howard Davis created the phone car. The phone car has been featured in many books, including Ripley's, Art Cars, Guinness, Motor Trend, and Weekly World News. The phone car is built on a 1975 Volkswagen Beetle chassis. It has an aluminum body and a tinted windshield which allows the driver to see clearly. It has a telephone ringer as its horn. So instead of a honk, it rings. Number 4. Peel P50 Peel P50 is the world's smallest car. One person can barely fit inside a P50, and at 130 pounds, the car might weigh less than the driver. Despite being designed during the Kennedy administration, the P50 does have some modern features. For example, it is mid-engined, just like a Ferrari 458. By mid-engined, the company means that the engine is in the cabin alongside the driver. A car that can only go 28 miles per hour does not seem very useful, but the Pill P50 has some major advantages over normal size autos. It gets an estimated 118 miles per gallon without any batteries, electric motors, or regenerative braking. It makes the Pill EV's 35 mile range seem kind of silly. Number 3. 1955 Chrysler Gia Gilda Built at the request of Chrysler executive Virgil Exner, the Gia Gilda was an exercise in extreme styling and ambitious performance. It debuted at a car show at Salon de Torino in 1955, later touring around Europe, then the US. The car was nicknamed after Rita Hayworth's performance in the 1946 film noir classic Gilda. 
Gia Gilda has been called one of the 10 most significant show cars by Strother McMinn. The initial idea was to power the Gilda by a gas turbine engine, but that never happened. At the time, Gia released a theoretical top speed figure of 140 miles per hour, 225 kilometers per hour. But it went untested probably due to the engine choice. Never intended for production, the car had no rear suspension and was never driven. Number 2. Limo Jet At 42 feet long, the Limo Jet began its life as a regional aircraft manufactured by Learjet, according to Autoblog. But then designer Dan Harris of Oregon got the bright idea to turn it into something a little more, well, grounded. So after two years of research and development, and with 40,000 man-hours of work overseen by Chicago-based exotic coach, the Limo Jet made its public debut during the summer of 2018. The plane upon which this limousine is based is a Lear Jet. Though it soars no more, it roars because it's loaded to the grills with audio gear. Guests find a 4500 watt stereo system that can likely replicate the noise once created by the jet engines. Or they can just immerse themselves in an audiovisual experience by watching a show on one of the five onboard televisions. The cabin was loaded with lights and it had enough seating for a frat house party. Number 1. 1970 Ferrari 512 S in 1970, Ferrari began production of the 512S to challenge the Porsche opposition. It was named after its 5-liter V12 engine and the sport class which it raced in CSIA FIA events. Unfortunately, the Ferrari 512 was largely unsuccessful at upsetting Porsche dominance. Although the 512 was much better balanced, the updated 917 was much faster and could reach speeds of 245 miles per hour. The 1970 Ferrari 512S was based on the 312P chassis, which had a steel space frame reinforced by aluminum panels. Hope you enjoyed this video. Which one did you like the most? Let us know in the comments. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do so. See you in the next video.